Hi, Mark Gordon with GoldenTicker.com on Wednesday, July 25th, 2012, uh, with a gold report. Uh, this is the GLD, the gold ETF, up about 1.6% right now. We are making some headway here. Uh, we had a gap up this morning, uh, taking us above this blue line here, the 50-day moving average, and above this red line here, the 21-day moving average. Good sign here. We are up against this head wall, though. This is a this dotted line here. This blue dotted line is an overhead trend line that has been nasty uh, for months now, uh, coming all the way back here to March, to early March. We have tapped this thing many, many times on the way down, and uh, right now we are back in that range here. Uh, although this is the farthest we've gotten above it. Uh, back here at the beginning of July, we got up above it as well. Um, but we are, are, are a bit uh, farther above it than we were then. Um, we uh, may be coming up here to test this green dotted line, the 100-day moving average. Uh, in my view, if we get two uh, closes, uh, daily closes above this line, it will negate this overhead trend line, and uh, which could be great for gold here uh, and the sign that we're turning around. Another sign that we may be turning around is the fact that this trend line here that's starting to shape up is not as steep as the overall trend, uh, uh, trend line to the downside here. So uh, this is a good sign as well. Um, you'll see also that the 50 day moving average has flattened out and is now starting to turn up a bit. That hasn't happened in quite a long time here. Um, uh, going back, uh, uh, actually, uh, boy, uh, since, uh, since March here, this trend line has uh, been uh, actually at the end of March here and beginning of April it started to head down and has been heading down ever since. Now we're starting to turn up. Good sign here, 21 day moving average starting to turn up as well. So uh, not out of the woods yet, some positive signs for uh, the GLD on the daily chart. And when we go to the uh, gold chart uh, on a weekly basis, we can see this turnaround here. You can see this downturn that we've been uh, uh, stuck in here, and you can see us starting to peak above it now um, on this weekly chart here. Still below some key moving average lines here, so not out of the woods yet, but some positive signs here. Could we easily uh, break down from here and go down? Of course. Uh, but uh, this is the first uh, uh, you know, real good sign we've had in quite some time. Now moving on to a monthly chart of gold, uh, we have been stuck in a correction here for about 11 months. And uh, it's uh, from top to bottom, uh, we've had a correction of 20.5%. This is qualifying gold to be in a bear market right now. Uh, we are currently underneath this green dotted line, which is a 20 month moving average. A lot of traders, uh, longer term traders use this as a point of support. and. Um, uh, the fact that we're below it also confirms that we're in a bear market right now. We have had some tight monthly closes along this line here. Uh, so getting support here um, uh, you know, on a monthly basis. Uh, going back here to um, uh, a correction that began in 06 and took us almost to 08, uh, uh, certainly through the, the uh, better part of 07 here. Uh, this was a 17-month uh, uh, correction here, a 22.5% correction has a, a lot of similarities to what we're going through now. Uh, in fact, the uh, average uh, correction length has been around uh, uh, 17 months here. So uh, if we were going to use that as a barometer, we still have a few more months of, of corrective phase uh, in the gold uh, uh, before possibly uh, uh, you know, taking off to the upside. Certainly there's a lot of market fundamentals that are playing into gold's favor, the massive amount of money printing going on in order to save countries from, uh, from gloom and doom. Uh, Spain is the latest one begging for a bailout. This is money that, uh, that simply is created out of thin air, which will hurt uh, the price of paper currencies, which plays well into the hands of gold. So uh, very, very uh, uh, interesting uh, uh, events happening on the global front uh, that play into the hand of gold. So just recapping, gold going through a correction and um, uh, possibly some signs on a daily chart of, uh, of a, uh, a bit of a rally starting up. Let's watch that and see what happens. But for now, gold in a correction. So thank you for, uh, for listening and talk to you soon.